Welcome back to Evening Shade. I'm gonna fix the situation. It really looks like cottage cheese. It does. Do you wanna explain what happened? Absolutely not. <laughs> and I'm glad to be back and I'm glad you're here uh, I took a little break not because you're not worth spending time with you really really are I just took a little break because I didn't want to bore y'all to death <laughs> but I'm back and let's go <laughs> What are you doing? I caught you. Don't fast forward. Gotta watch the whole thing. <laughs> okay, so I want to tell you kind of what happened. I went over to my friend Diane's. We were making homemade ice cream. We put the cream cheese in with all the liquid, tried to run the blender, not the blender, the mixer, and it was just splattering everywhere. It, and there's chunks of cream cheese. It was delicious. I liked it that way. Diane, being the perfectionist she is, at following the recipe to the letter, she took the rest of the batch and strained it through a tea strainer. I'm gonna fix the situation. It really looks like cottage cheese. It does. Do you want to explain what happened? Absolutely not. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all have to just guess what happened. That's not cottage cheese. Okay. That's actually from the first time around trying to blend the cream cheese in after the milk was added instead of creaming it before the milk was added, right? I'm just sit. I'm dealing with a cooking perfectionist here. She wants the lumps out. I thought it tasted good with them. to all that trouble to do that Lori happened I broke the machine yes I broke it I don't think it's still working I don't think that it's going to do it that way I think that the, this thing has to keep the paddle in place so only the bottom is turning. finger off that button. Don't fast forward. Don't leave. Hit subscribe and like. So I've got to get this trash burned. I've had a few coyotes come right up to this back fence lately. Uh, the other day when it was snowing saw one out here grabbed my camera totally missed getting it on camera though but they usually don't come in this close but i really got behind on burning the trash so 
even with the scent of the dogs and the dogs here in the yard, they're trying to come up really close. So I got to get that took care of. <laughs> Yeah, it was so warm a couple days ago. I sat out here and got a little sun. Had a wasp, two wasps, two or three wasps, a honeybee, a couple little, I don't know what they were buzzing me. A couple little unknowns. <laughs> anyway, so it was warm enough to sit out and get sun. It was in the upper 70s, and then that night it started snowing. Sorry, I'm trying to latch the gate and talk. So yeah, 70 something, almost 80 degrees. One day I'm sitting out in the sun. That night it starts snowing. The next morning I get up to snow everywhere. Still have a little bit of snow in the yard or ice where it's shady all day. But for the most part, it is all gone. Thank goodness it did not stay. Huh, guys? <laughs> well, it's dark. You can't really see me, but hi. <laughs> all right, let's go in where it's warm.